Good morning, friends. This is a morning of me in my car. My cousin called and asked if I could take my niece to the orthodontist, and that's great, and I don't mind helping out, but my niece's orthodontist is five minutes away from my house, literally. And my niece, however, is about 25 minutes away from my house. So I left my house, drove across town, grabbed my niece, brought her back to her orthodontist, and then went home because it's only five minutes away and it was gonna be about a 30 minute appointment or so, and now I'm headed back to pick her up. <laughs> the things we do for our family. Oh my gosh. But anyway, that's okay. Um, minutes at home were very productive. I put a check in the mail for my sister for some C's candy. My nephew, Everett, his school, his elementary school, is selling, selling C's candy as a fundraiser. So Lila RC, you'll be happy to hear that. Lila loves C's candy. Um, who doesn't? I don't know. And the order will be in, my sister said, in a couple of weeks. So she said she'll send it, but I don't know. We'll try to head down there maybe and go uh, and go get it. I think my sisters and I always try to get together after Thanksgiving, not Black Friday though, but before Christmas to do a little girls pre-Christmas shopping trip. So hopefully that will be happening and then I can pick up my C's candy. Okay, so here I am at the orthodontist to pick up my niece at the orthodontist that is five minutes from my house. That's okay. And what time is it? It's 11.30, so I don't know how her mouth is feeling, but she'll probably want to go get a Jamba Juice. Okay, that's what I'm going to say, so we'll see what ends up happening. And how did it go? It went good. I, just, I got new rubber bands and I got that thing. Let me see. When did they say your... Uh, they said in a couple months. Were coming up. They said Two a couple more months. months? Couple, yeah. Oh, wow. I know, but they have to do an x-ray because another tooth cut is coming in right here. Like in the back, so they might have to put a bracket on that one too. Does it hurt? No. Oh. So everything was okay? Did you call your mom and tell her? Yeah. What'd she say? She said that like she'll schedule an appointment so like the, then they can take it off. When do they want to do that? Um, I don't know. They said in like January or oh so not January, right away February. yeah okay you hungry thirsty thirsty what do you feel like um uh, you can pick no you pick um starbucks starbucks is fine <laughs> i thought you were gonna say jamba juice last time we got jamba juice yeah that's right when i brought you the ortho that's right What's your Jamba Juice drink? On the stream machine. Now, what do you get at Starbucks? The, I forgot what it's called. It's like the caramel macchiato or something. Oh. You actually get a coffee drink? Yeah. Yikes. <laughs> okay. So, Starbucks it is. What do you get? Same thing, Americano. Either <laughs> cold or hot, depending on what I feel like. So. I get my cold. You know, they, always, they have all those seasonal drinks and yeah. all those crazy I never try those do you mm -hmm. my sister tried one Tammy tried one a lot a couple of times ago when she was here and and she says the same thing she said I don't know why I try those she said I never like them <laughs> you just get stuck on your regular one you like mm -hmm. uh, I tried the the pumpkin spice one because my friend had it yeah. and it tasted so bad and I was like because it, it, it like it's too sweet no, it didn't taste, it, it was like not sweetened at all. Oh. And it just, it tasted like, like if I, if I had a pumpkin, it would taste like better than that. It would taste sweeter than that. So it didn't taste like pumpkin or it did? No, it didn't. And like oh. it had, it just tasted like cinnamon, but like bitter cinnamon. Oh. Hmm. It tasted bad. But then my friend got the pumpkin spice thing mm -hmm. from Dutch Bros. Uh -huh. And that one actually tastes good. Do people still go to Dutch Bros yeah. all the time? It's still a thing? Yeah. Oh. It's my favorite place. 
there uh, a water main broke. That's why that's all that. Oh, I was, I was wondering. Yeah, broke last, I think like last Friday or something. The street was all flooded. Jeez. So now they're, it's, they said it's going to probably be all week because they had to fix it because they had to um, take up the concrete and stuff. Mm. So anyway. So we'll go a different way to get there. <laughs> your mom you want to get contacts yeah we were supposed to get them last time but then but like they were trying to like double the price oh because i needed glasses too isn't it kind of a pain wearing your glasses do you have to wear them when you do soccer and cheer no not really soccer and cheer i don't i don't wear them for sports oh just just like for like in like in class and like whenever i put them in, like on in class mm -hmm. like oh my god brooke you're a nerd with your glasses and braces it's like whatever <laughs> Freshmen do not want to wear glasses and braces. No. Uh -uh. <laughs> so one of them has to go. Yeah. That's why I never. That's why I never wear my glasses. Like, like other than like when I'm reading. Like in class, if I don't need them, like okay, I'll just take them off real quick. And then like I'll write something. And like if they put something on the board, I'm like. <sighs> and then, like I look. Yeah, one of them has to go. <laughs> Preferably these ones. That's so cool. What'd you get at the Dollar Tree? I got wall stuff, and I got a present for my oldest sister, Nicole. You got something for you, too. Oh, yeah, I got mascara. Okay. You got those sticky wall things, yeah. huh? Oh, show them. What do you got? Yeah, that's cute. That, and then this one says, um, the best way to predict the future is to create it. I see. That's cute. Very cute. And mascara, and then something for your sister. Yep. You have a cute idea that you're going to do, and a cute box. I know. Show your cute box that you're going to do. Or that you got. That's cute, huh? And then she got a white cup, and she's going to write on it and decorate it for her sister. I hope she likes it. I'm sure she will. There was a lot of people at the dollar store, weren't there? Yeah, there was. Oh, my God. And so now it's time for you to go home and do some chores. Yep. And learn my permit so I can drive. That's right. Brooke's very excited to drive. First, you have to take the written test. Yeah, oh, I'm really nervous about that one. When are you planning on taking it? Um, like the la or like the last week of December. Oh, okay. And then after, and in the meantime, you're just gonna be in the car practicing. Yeah. Nice. It's gonna be good. <laughs> then you'll be running the streets. I know. People watch out. Hi, friends. So I am back from my little adventure with my cute niece after I dropped her off at home and dad was home, so that was good. And I stopped at the bulldog shop. It's everything Fresno State for the most part. Picked up a couple of Christmas gift and got a new alumni license plate cover so I can change that, which I will do. And now I am back home. So I have a meeting tonight, again, usual, Catholic Daughters, so I need to make some cookies. I'm going to make chocolate chip, I believe. I did, oh, and I need to put away the stuff that Brooke and I um, got at the dollar store. I can't show you that. I would show you, but a lot of the things that I got, I'm going to be using for my cookie exchange with my friends next month. I'm not sure if they watch my channel or not, but I just don't wanna um, do that and I don't know. Anyway, I'm not gonna do a dollar store haul, even though I spent close to $50, but that's okay. I will tell you the one thing that I did buy was Lisa. You bought the little teether that you put in the freezer that's shaped like an ice cream cone. I saw that. I thought, you know what? I don't know. My granddaughter might be teething in the next two, three, four months, so I'm going to save that, and then maybe in a couple months when she actually officially starts teething, I will put it in the freezer and have it ready. It's so interesting spending some time with a teenager. I haven't spent time with the Brooke, even she said that. Um, we haven't spent time together, just you and me in a while, and she's right. It's very interesting to hear high school talk 
Oh my goodness. So um, she talked about a few interesting things. I'm sure she doesn't want me talking about with you guys, but um, Brooke, sweetie, I know she watches my videos. Brooke, sweetie, I love you. And um, everything's gonna be wonderful. It sounds like you're doing a great job at high school. that's all for now. Talk to you guys later.